<laughs> oh, Pedro is shedding. Lethargic? I'm making a little video. Pedro is shedding. Look at her. Aww. Oh my gosh, I've never seen that before. Yeah. Oh, can I hear me? Yeah. <laughs> uh, so the kids have been watching her that we've been freaking out how white she was, but I wasn't freaked out because this has happened before. I did clean up some of her poops that were right here in the foreground, knowing what was going to happen. She is unhappy with us. This is a private matter. <laughs> I wish I'd taken that little log thing out of there. She's shedding, and it, it happens when she gets too big. You all shed little tiny yeah. bits of skin all the time. But poor little Pedra, she's a reptile, and she uh, sheds all at once. And we discovered she eats it. And I'm thinking that might be a kind of a neat thing. I mean, it might be protection. I'm going to move this light out of the way. So I'm looking down on her right now. She's not going to be happy with me. But I think this might be protection against predators because she doesn't have much of a protection. And she is soft and tender on her tummy. She's going to be sad. I'm debating. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Oh, there's one. I can plug it if you want to leave it in my chair. We're talking about a computer. That's my friend, but she will not want you, me to say her name, I bet. I'm going to take out this log. Pedro, if you, um, I hope this doesn't stress you too much. I think she's kind of vulnerable right now. But ooh, that looks, it looks like it's a sheet hanging on her, doesn't it? That black thing you see is a little thermometer. And because I got a little heating pad underneath there. And she, I think, has, so there's little splashes or something. She has scratched off. See, she's eating it a little. She scratched off places, and it started peeling. There's another video uh, on YouTube about this. It's called Pedro, Pedro Sheds. <laughs> this might be a stressful thing for her. I feel kind of bad about taking that log away. I'm going to focus in on her. Get focus right back out. Hmm. I think it's maybe wanting to focus on her leg or something. Goodness, maybe it's focusing on the debris. This is irritating to me. Hitting the phone right now. There we go. It's still doing it. Maybe I'll zoom out. That big opening on the side of her head is her ear, on her neck, kind of. Oh, and I see a little bit one of one of her little toes. You see a little bit of white still left. She's peeling it off her back foot and eating it. But I'm, like I was trying to say, I think that having, um, and she's gently taking it off her toes, the having the skin eaten up, it's an extra source of protein for her. But also, if it was laying around, a predator would know she was there, wouldn't they? Little holes poked in it. She does this a lot, but this is rarely do I get to see it. Oh, I removed her scratching surface. Oh, Pedro. She didn't have anything to scratch it with. I'm going to put that log back in there. Bless her heart. Oh, sorry, Pedro. I'll put that back in there for you, baby. Selfish of me. 
Don't make it on your pigs, though. I'm going to put it over here so she doesn't. I'm going to accidentally put it on her. No? Well, I'll just move it over. Because I'm clumsy <laughs> with this thing. Okay. Now. You may want to have a look at you, little pretty thing. She's so interesting. She's trying to rub against the glass to get it off. You can see the texture underneath it. Look at that. She's scratching it on that surface. Can you see? <laughs> trying to reach it off with her foot. Love her. You know, I bet you kids would like if I could peel off a piece of it and have it for us to look at. I hope that doesn't... Oh, she's probably just like, I just wish you'd leave me alone. It's okay, baby. It's okay. She always thinks I'm a predator. I want to tear off a piece so you all can see it. Pretty dry, and you can still see the spots, or maybe those are the tears. Here's this. It felt just like dry. Hmm. I don't know what it felt like. I've got a little rolled up pieces of duct tape right here uh, so that lifts the tank off the surface of the cabinet so it won't get too hot. Because there's a heating pad underneath it. So watch, when she takes it off her foot, it's kind of like Peeling, um, taking a glove off inside out. You can see the spots on it. Can you see the darker places on it from the tail? Her tail's nice and fat. She stores her food there. Some of her toes still have little bits of skin. What I think will happen is she'll probably get in the water later and it'll soften up and come off easily. This thing was really dry. It's colder weather, maybe is why it's dry. I'm gonna look. Yeah, it's just 55% humidity in here right now. Look at that little sock of it on her foot. And some on her toes. The toes are irritating to her. Bless her little heart. Wouldn't this be a bummer to have to do every day? Or not every day, every few days or every week. Or a few weeks, depending on how much you ate. It comes off like I'm pulling a glove off. Did you hear it? Crunch. It's really dry. I'm going to mist her. I have a little uh, water bottle. And I put just spring water in it. Plus her little toes. That's uncomfortable for her. I wish she'd get in the water. 
I think how uncomfortable that is. It's too dry in there. She's trying to scratch it off her head. Lover. Poor little girl. Just trying to rub against the glass to get it off. It's not very effective, I'm thinking. I wonder if I've got that water bottle nearby. No, I don't. See the spots in that skin still. I don't know what would be more stressful, me reaching in and taking that off her head or her just having to deal with it herself. What a oh, bummer not to have opposable fingers, Pedro. She used to be Pedro, but we figured out that she was a girl, so she's Pedro now. in the water. Don't bite off your toe accidentally. She's got little sharp teeth. She bit me before. I'm going to pause this and see if I can find a water bottle. Okay. I got a water bottle. I'm gonna get the little nozzle turned to spray. Looks like she's wanting to go in the water anyway, though. I'm gonna spray away from her onto the back wall. If it'll do. This isn't the one I usually have for her. Okay, I'm gonna let it just rain on her a little. I don't wanna scare her. Maybe he likes it, I don't know. I'm probably just terrorizing her. Okay, I'm just going to stop recording. I'm going to see if I can encourage her to go into the water. I think that would be her best bet. She'll be okay.